Hey, this is Jameson Van S here with another house that we picked up at Trust Sale. This is a before video. The address on this is 14909 Lamoille, or Lamoille, located in Kingswood Park. We picked this house up at Trust Sale for $64,000 on a drop bid. House has got really nice bones. And uh, you can see there's a lot of leaf litter and stuff in the front yard. Once we get done with our um, landscaping uh, cleanup, this will look real nice and manicured. I'll give you a look at the inside so when you see the after photos, you know exactly what we did. Nice fixture there. You'll probably work with that. Uh, tile floors look like they were a little bit newer. Um, but it's not real uh, in today, so we're going to bust all that out like we normally do, and we'll go with a nice neutral brown uh, uh, tile, probably an 18 by 18 or 20 by 20. I think in this one we're going to keep the appliances. We typically do stainless steel. However, these appliances are in really good shape, and because it's a smaller house, try to save a little money, we'll keep those. Um, these are the standard oak cabinets been seeing those a lot in the houses we've done lately and we'll just add the hardware and dress them up countertops a lot of countertop space in this house which is going to be pretty nice um, the uh, colors brown but we're going to take that out and put granite in it's not really um, going to fit in when we get done and we've got some problems right here with it chipping and cracking so we'd have to match that so rather than trying to do that, we're going to go ahead and pull that and we'll put granite. Almost all the windows have blinds. There are a few that don't have blinds, so we'll have to uh, work on those. Um, flooring, definitely going to have to come out carpet-wise. You can kind of see there, there's some stains. Um, and it's just we typically don't uh, shampoo carpets. We you know usually repair them or take them out and replace them. Um, so... That will be definitely something that we will do. Um, house is basic white, so we'll do some two-tone paint on that. Jazz it up. It's a nice looking fixture. I think we can salvage that. Uh, back here in the hallway, we have an uh, extra closet, storage closet. Over here we got another storage closet. And we have a washer and dryer set up in here as well. Tile floors, we'll take that out. Most likely what we'll probably do, rather than do carpet in this great room, we'll just go ahead and do tile that whole thing. We'll tile all the way in here, through the hallway. So the only place that there'll be any carpet will be the bedrooms. Here's a nice bedroom as well. Got a fan in it. We can save that, I think. Already got the blinds. Here's the bathroom. Actually got a nice mirror. Pretty nice fixture on it. Um, looks like it's a newer faucet. Doesn't really go together with the fixture, but we'll have to take a look at that when we get done and see where we're at. We'll add the hardware on the uh, cabinets to dress that up. Once again, this will all be the main tile that we put in. In here, we're missing some blinds, so we'll have to add those. Once again, we got the doors and a standard flat panel. It just really date the house. Um, probably go to our two panel arch on that. Just have to see if it's in the number. Unfortunately, there's a lot of doors in this house. There's almost 18, and it's just going to kind of hinge upon whether or not we can get it out of it. Looks like they had a dog here, so we got a dog door. Because it's in a bedroom, we'll probably box that in, drywall it, and we'll have to restucco the outside. Um, you can see here they got the standard gold hardware. Looks like it's from the 70s, so we'll take that out and put the oil rub bronze. It's the master. Pretty small master closet. Got the wire shelving, which I'm not a fan of, but um, probably just keep it and uh, put in some new carpet. Do the Berber that we usually do. These blinds are plastic and don't match the rest of the house. We'll change those out. And as you can see, we got a nice lime green paint here that needs to be uh, repainted, and we'll do our standard brown that we do. And once again, the master. 
Um, standard tub shower combo um, instead of a separate tub and shower, which uh, not a huge fan of, but in these small houses you take what you get sometimes. Uh, once again, they got the, the tile in here that's that's not real pretty, so we'll make that a little more neutral and make the uh, work with the cabinets a little better. I'm going to go outside, out back, show you what we got here. Nice double doors. Need a little adjustment, they're not working the best. And got a nice patio slab. This particular house doesn't have a patio cover, but it does have the footing already put into it. So we'll have to take a look at that. Probably just sell it as is. You know, it's a smaller house and you know the footing's there. If someone wants to add a covered patio, they can. Lots of rock. It is a pretty good sized yard, which is definitely an advantage. If someone ever wants to put in a pool or put some extra grass, they can. There's just not much back here. So we'll clean this up, make it look presentable. Won't put too much effort in this. Uh, mainly focus our uh, efforts on the inside of the house. Because if the inside's nice, uh, the rest of it will uh, work. So stay tuned. We will be updating here in the next week or so with a new video that shows the final rehab product on this house. Unless for some instance, some for some reason someone buys it, we actually had a showing today on it and they expressed interest, so we may uh, just wholesale it out to them, but um, that uh, remains to be seen. So this is Jameson, and we'll talk to you next time.